is playing with my emotions, knowing that I have to go to the dentist. I need a new cell phone, a new new laptop, new everything. I try to hold on to this electronics so the wheels fall off, but I think these wheels are long <laughs> gone. Okay, let's see. Finally, it's working. I'm like, should I take the stairs or the elevator? The stairs. <laughs> I can't discern. I'm taking the elevator today. so funny because one of the employees when I walked in to come in the um, room she's like oh you look so familiar I'm like yeah a couple years ago you guys were so nice and you made me a retainer and here I am again needing braces well hopefully I don't need braces but needing braces again so I'm pray down and sure hope I don't need braces again but if I do so be it but I think I do this is a different braces but last time these are Invisalign, but last time I got the clear braces. So if I have to get braces again, I'm definitely gonna get the clear ones. And, um, but this time it shouldn't be that long, but I'm waiting for the orthodontist now to see because the orthodontist that I originally had is upstate New York. And anyways, Dr. Duffy retired, unfortunately, because <laughs> otherwise I would have went upstate New York to Dr. Duffy. So yeah, but I think they're great here too because they're my dentist, so. We'll see. I have to pray for the best. I guess it just could be worse. Ooh. I definitely don't want these braces though, but like all the colors and stuff, because I just don't want all those colors in my mouth. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm getting nervous waiting for the other donuts. I noticed about like the people in like the dentistry field. It's like they don't age. <laughs> like my orthodontist, Dr. Duffy, he retired. I'm like, retired, what? He's so young. I don't know how old he is. Um, of course, I would never ask, but um, he just looks so young. And like all like the hygienists or other general dentists, they just look so young. I just feel like some of them are like some of the most beautiful people ever. I don't know what it is with that uh, field. Mm. I just wonder if you have a sitting area that's sort of quiet um, over there. It's in the cafe. It's okay. quiet today. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. The final verdict regarding the braces situation is... Yes, I don't know why this camera is so grainy. I don't know. I'm using a different type of camera. I don't know if this is a better camera. But anyways, yes. So I have to get braces again. And at first when I went in, I figured that I had to get braces. But... I wanted to get the clear braces, the ones that I had before, and I was like adamant on it. But then the orthodontist educated me. He was like, well, you know, if you really want the clear braces, we can make it happen. But I'm like, no, you know what I mean? Like, you know best <laughs> in this situation. Um, Cause he was saying that the metal ones are more hygienic than the clear ones. So yeah, if they're better for you, then, why is it just like them now? Then, you know, if they're more hygienic, then of course I'll want the ones that are more hygienic. So, yeah, that's the perfect And I was told that I might be getting them. Well, yeah, they said they can do them. Is it wrong? And they can do them as early as next week. And I would only need them for a few months. That's what they're saying. But we'll see. Because sometimes I feel like. The orthodontist be saying that and you have them up for like two years. But he did say that just my top ones are, um, are going to get braces. My bottom ones are fine, obviously. But that's just what it is. So I'm just going to. Just going to have to. Just going to have to embrace it. 
like before. Yesterday, I ended up going to Barnes and Nobles because I spent longer at that orthodontist than expected and I had a meeting. Like yesterday, everything was like so micromanaged because I had meetings back to back to back. So I had my final meeting of the day and um, of course, 76 was so busy. So I'm like, oh, I'm not gonna make it. I'm definitely not gonna make this meeting. So I had to stop at Barnes and Nobles thinking that it was quiet and um, no one would be there and um, they don't have loud music, but it was pretty quiet compared to like Starbucks and the other places because their music is just so loud at those coffee shops. But anyways, so I went to Barnes and Nobles and I had to take the meeting. But you know what, thank God for like that background and like Zoom and Teams, but I did a Teams. You know how you can like change the filter background? Because some guy yesterday, when I was sitting down at my meeting, I felt him like breathing down my neck. He was like looking over, like looking in my um, in the screen, trying to see what I was doing and who I was talking to. I'm like, thank God for that filter, so they couldn't like see my background. But alhamdulillah, it all worked out very well, and I'm just so excited. But yeah, just gotta act fast. And I don't know why the camera. This is a new camera that I'm using. It's so grainy. It almost looks grainy. I don't know. But anyways, yeah. I just wish coffee shops were not that loud. Maybe I should develop a silent coffee shop. Because I always wonder, how, how do people go to, like, coffee shops and, like, study? I'm like, how do you do that when the music is blasting in your ear? That is so distracting to me. But maybe that's just me. I don't know. But anyways, yeah. That's just what it is. <laughs>